Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to Living Uniquely You, myself, Sharon Brown. I hope you are all doing well on this Thursday afternoon. I am coming in to release all that you're holding on to for from 2020. So we are on, um, it's actually New Year's Eve. We are going to step into those new energies of 2021. I feel personally what 2021 is about it's about us progressing now that we have started doing the inner work we've really gone in and really looking at what is going on hiya karen what is going on what we don't want in our life and what we really do want in our life so it's about making the decision and really stepping into that energy of freedom progression and um, really taking the action that we want and allowing ourselves to take that action 2020 has really been a very turbulent year for us all we've had so many ups and downs energy wise it's just been absolutely off the charts and um, it's been personally it's been great for me to go in i've done an awful lot of inner work i know a lot of um, my clients done really really deep in our work and um then it's really about seeing what we're holding on to what the triggers are what our patterns are and letting them all go that was 2020 with a lot of karmic stuff in 2020 but now hi Regina, happy new year to you the same to you karen and anybody else that's watching but 2021 now is it's going to be a turbulent start a lot of us in Ireland are in lockdown. The UK users are in lockdown. Half the world is in lockdown. So we are going to have a turbulent couple of months. I would say the first three months are going to be quite turbulent. That's my opinion. Everybody else is different. That's what I feel. I have a feeling it's really shaken us. And anyone that hasn't gone in to do the inner work are literally being shaken. Basically, wake up. Do the work, let it go and move forward because 2021 is about action and progress. So I'm going to bring in the energy, bring in the light codes. I'm going to do a bit of drumming and I'm going to help you release all that you may be holding on to from 2020. We've had some very sad times over this this year. A lot of people have lost loved ones to, to the virus. Um, it's been very sad. People not being able to see family, friends celebrations all that has been knocked on the head and basically now it's time to let all that sadness all the grief and anything else that we're holding on to just let it all go and allowing us to bring in that new energy of 2021 so i'm just going to ask you to take a deep breath in and just calling all your energies back from people, places, situations, time and space. So bringing all your energies fully, fully back in. Allowing it to go through that divine filter of pure love and light. Allowing, allowing, just calling yourself all the way back. We're very scattered, so bringing it all the way back in through that divine filter of pure love and light. And breathe out. Take another deep breath in. And just allowing your energies to fully, fully drop back into you. So just allowing your energies to fully drop into you. And breathe out. Take another deep breath in. And just acknowledge how you're feeling, not wanting to change anything. <clears throat> and breathe out. Bring your awareness to your heart and then as you bring your awareness to your heart, visualise two big golden roots coming out of your heart, into your solar plex, into your sacral chakra, your root, your hips, your legs, your feet, the floor, right down into your earth star chakra and into the core of Mother Earth. Feeling your energy and Mother Earth's energy combining as one 
and feeling this energy now move up into your earth star chakra pulling your earth star chakra all the way down 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 right down into the center of the crystalline grid all the way down into your rightful place this is your rightful place allowing you to fully anchor in your energy feeling your roots wrap around the crystalline grid feeling the second part of the grid come up and really anchor in your energy to your rightful place on this earth feeling this energy move up into your feet your legs your hips your root your sacral chakra your solar plex and your heart center doing a 360 degree around your heart center calling in the energy from source coming straight down into your stellar gateway clearing anything that is stopping you from having divine connection into your causal chakra so your intuition sorry into your soul star chakra so you can see sense and feel your true soul's path allowing that to fully il illuminate in front of you giving yourself the permission to step forward this year is all about action into the crown into your causal chakra so you can bring in guidance bringing in the guidance just allowing you to see sense and feel the guidance into the crown of your head so you can think more clearly into your ear third eye so you can see more clearly into your ear chakra so you can hear divine guidance into your throat chakra so you can speak your truth with pure love and light into the higher heart so you can connect into that universal energy of pure love and allowing you to fully anchor that within your life and body into your heart so you could love you you can see your beauty inside and out. You can see your beautiful self. Into your solar plex so you can unleash your true divine masculine energies, allowing them to fully balance within the body and fully accepting yourself no matter what. Into your sacral chakra so you can unleash your true divine feminine energies allowing them to fully balance within your body and remembering and reawakening your true gifts and talents into the root chakra so you can bring in the abundance of life and all life has to offer into your hips your legs your feet the floor right down into your earth star chakra and into the core of mother earth feeling this energy now move up into your feet your root and your heart doing a 360 degree around your heart chakra feeling your energy mother earth's energy and father sky's energy combining as one and feeling this energy move to every part of your body every part of your being right down into your zero point allowing you to go right into that oneness and just allowing and anything that you feel you may be holding on to from 2020 giving yourself that permission to let it all go so just giving yourself the permission to let it all go mm -hmm.
energy of that elephant came in at the end well 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 that obviously is our spirit animal guide for the year 2021 is the beautiful elephant so any obstacles that you may feel um that are in your way or you feel you can't get around call in the energy of the spirit animal the elephant they are a beautiful energy they are a very family orientated strong powerful they have great strength and loyalty is just they are just all about loyalty and family that is the beautiful spirit animal of the elephant i am pulling um a card from on oh, the upside down from this deck <laughs> things falling on me um for I feel it's for 2021 because um, I'm not going to be on tomorrow. I have my portal activation tomorrow. So um, 
I won't be on tomorrow. Hi, Sarah. Hello, Carol. Hello, everybody that's watching. Thank you for watching this and thank you for watching the replay. Sarah, yes, we do have a portal tomorrow at 101. I will be doing the code in the next hour or so and I will put it in the group. I am so looking forward to our portal tomorrow. We have the raccoon for 2021 and it's all about hiya mary it's all about yvonne how are you um the raccoon to me is removing the mask it's just about let removing the mask letting the world see your true self emerging to that beautiful self allowing yourself to go through that transformation um what else is the raccoon the raccoons are very um they love to take action and um, they are great inventors so it's all about i feel 2021 is about reinventing ourselves stepping out to our true unique divine self allowing the world to see you for who you truly are it's about taking center stage of your life and really, really stepping into your light. Some of you might know what that is yet. I have a feeling the first three months of this year is really going to shake a lot of people up. Um, it's really going to, to um, say, look, is this really what, like 2020, look, is this really what you want? But it's also going to show people new ways of doing things, new avenues opening, doors opening and allowing you to step into your true unique self. And that's what the action and the freedom, the energy of that freedom is giving yourself the permission to do that. So it's freeing your soul, allowing the soul to sing and really step out into that center stage of your life. Now I'm going to read the card. <laughs> I see a lot of, there's one, two, three raccoons and they're all looking at this beautiful butterfly. And that's about the transformation. We've had some hard year. So well done to everyone that has gone through it. Um, remember, we're coming back into lockdown. It is what it is. We just have to get on with it. We've been through it already. We'll get through it again. In inventor and i said about the raccoons being the inventor decide on what you really want this is exactly what i'm after saying you have the in uh, you have the in you have the ability to claim it avoid being the trickster and practice you have many roles and can juggle them all well so it's it is looking at our true divine self looking at ourself and what I'm getting is let go of what no longer serves you. What we're after doing, we're after letting go of that 2020 energy and allowing us to step into that beautiful new 2021 energy. It really is about stepping into ourselves, our true divine self. Enough playing small. As um, I said to a client there not so long ago, we are the ones that only stop ourselves. It's all the shit, all the, I'm sorry, but it's all the bullshit that we tell ourselves. I've done it myself for years. I still do on certain days tell myself, even before I came on live, I was going, do I really want to go live? And then I'm getting in my head, you have to go live, you have to go live, you have to go live. So we do stop ourselves. I even do it myself. We're only human, guys. We are here to live that human experience. Unfortunately, we have to be a human it's we all have problems we all have stuff nobody's life is perfect nobody's life is perfect so it's about rising above the drama stepping out of the drama keeping yourself in your own lane and really really allowing your true divine self to shine and allowing your soul to be free and on that note Happy New Year to every single one of you. I hope you have a magical New Year's Eve. And thank you very much for anyone that has worked with me on a one-to-one -one basis in a group, watched me live, shared anything. If I can help one person through this live every single day, well, that 
that is good enough for me um, and of course um, I have my portal activation tomorrow. I'm so looking forward to that. We have um, huge energy coming in tomorrow. If you would like to join that portal activation group, please let me know. As of today, no, as of tomorrow, it's going up to 22.22. But anyone that joins today will get it at 13.33. So have a magical day, guys. Happy New Year. And I will talk to you all again on Monday. Take care. Bye.